welcome guys to the another video of game of sultans and in this video what we gonna to see is that's about the friends point and close relationship okay so let's just start without wasting our time with this patch you can add a friend with your cross server how you gonna to add them is very simple either send them friend request by visiting and clicking on their avatar but it can be only done for cross server friends or the cross region friends you must know their player id you have nothing to do just click on this uh, add friend sign if you know their player id and then uh, paste their id here or you can also write them i can i will paste uh, some ids okay then you can see i have already added him as my friend he has accepted my friend request okay so that's all you need to do for sending friends either cross region either cross server cross region means if you are in asia server you can send friend request to the asian or european server too and the same european and american server can do either so guys you can see one more thing the search tab right here this is available to filter your friend list suppose you want to search any friend in the short time then you just need their names or their player id you can enter their name or player id right here and it will search the whole friend list in a short duration okay like this let me show you like search with their name You see, this is uh, like as so written F I Y A. It don't search with. It only search as okay. So this is some glitch, I think. It so better search with player ID. Let to go with player ID one three five seven eight. Player ID is more specific and more accurate than the player's name. If you have to search a player's name then try to type their first name because you know everyone use different format of player name so it's kind of hard to search with their names so you can go with uh, player ids or if you want to search their names with uh, like first two letter or three letters then it will be fine okay so this is all about sending friend request now we want to see is what are these friend points okay you can see these heart sign beside the name of your every friend so what are these hearts really and what are the close relationships so, so first what we going to see is friends point okay so simply these friends two points are the individual points given to each of your friends by you or either by them if you gift them some gifts which have positive effect on your friendship or they give you some gift which have positive effect on your both sides of your friendship okay positive effect uh, you can see which gift you have to gift is very simple you can either gift them from your backpack directly or either very simple to gift is right from here just click on any of your friends now here you can see this uh, gift box icon okay just click on here then you will see these are the gifts you can gift and there here you can see this next level and friendship points okay this friendship point is how much friendship point you have reached by gifting the items to your friend and this much uh, points is left to reach to the next level of your friendship okay this is what these points shows now come down below these are the gifts you can give gift them normally okay and this gift you can see this uh, ruby rose you can get this item from either organizing feast purchase or say any event okay these are the ways to get this ruby rose which will give you plus 100 friendship point so that's simple very simple okay as for these normal gifts it will give you plus 10 uh, friendship point each time you gift them and maximum you can gift at least only 60 gifts per week remember per week not per day you can gift maximum of uh, 60 gifts per week okay you can see it right here how much gift i have gifted and how much gift i can give i have gifted 37 out of 60 okay now from where you can see what you wanna to gain if you, you reach to the next friendship level okay or any other specific friendship level let's go back you can see right here this is the heart sign shape tap you have to just click on here okay just click on here now you can see this are the level of friendship so right here this is enough i am currently on friendship level first and when i reach friendship level 2 what i am gonna to gain is this okay 
when I reach there, then I will gonna to get two percent extra elegance gem. And if I join my friend's feast, then I am gonna to plus two percent token. Not any other friends. The only the friend you have reached the specific friendship level. Okay. And if I send my budgies to a study in their imperial academy, then remember this is friend specific. Every individual friends have different friendship points. So you have to like uh, be specific with your friends whom you choose or how much gift you give which friend okay so if you give send your budgets to a study in their academy then you there is 30 percent chance to gain like plus two book xp or 20 skill xp okay this is all for the friend uh, le friend level two now if you reach friend level three you can just uh, track it by clicking and right here this arrow sign okay and just go here now after reaching to the certain level you will see this uh, sweetheart first or confident first sweetheart second and confident second this is just the close relationship i will explain you in the last for now let's go with it okay now i am going to show you what if i gift uh, my friend something let's gift this guy i'm uh, have uh, already in this is 970 i'm gonna to gift my some like these delight -like boxes 980 990 1000 okay uh, now i have reached the 1k you can see here these are now i'm gonna to get now i will show you is it really gives plus two percent so i'm going to start with uh, like a uh, feast tokens as I have already joined any other player study room so I can't show you about elegance gem but I will show you about feast token so you can confirm it okay so let's go directly to the feast now go to the feast let's join you see monkey king's feast now if I join him let's see I'm using 100 diamonds so it is going to give me 100 tokens you can see right here it's written friends bonus de depending upon how you how you attend the feast you can get extra feast token plus two percent okay so i'm going to use my hundred diamonds right here i have joined and now you can see right here these are the tokens i have received friends bonus is plus two percent everyone know the how to drive the percentage so percentage of 100 token is plus two so i received plus two this is the same way you wanted to receive in either a companion hall or say in academy study but academy study has a still some percentage of chances it's a chance to receive plus two xp or third plus 20 skill xp okay so in if it comes to the academy hall then it all goes to like uh, some chance of boost same works in current academy okay so that's all for the friendship point so guys you have seen that uh, you can get plus two percent now one more thing you can do with this update is now you can even invite your cross server friends let me show you this is the feast i have organized and you can see here this is my cross server friend from the another server right here lucinista you can invite them to join your feast in your uh, study room either painting music or a uh, book study or you can even send your budgies to a study in their uh, academy halls as far as what changes in the haram companion hall then you can go here now you can even see this right here how much bonus your union members are giving or how much friends bonus you are getting so these are the some changes that happen in this companion hall detail system okay so it's pretty good changes developers have made right there okay now we're going to see what is close relationship and how we're going to appoint our close relationship okay so let's go to the close relationship section what you have to do is go to your friend list then you have noticed some changes right down below with these previous tab there is now fourth tab one you can have to just click on it after clicking on it you can see these are the some specific levels right here okay you can see there is some unlocking conditions right here use diamonds or reach royal sultan second to unlock this this part or uh, majestic sultan third to unlock this part 
you can also use diamonds to unlock them then now comes to here there are two tabs right here in the below okay so let me explain you all the steps first tab you can see here you this is uh, like a uh, remove relationship tab if you want to use this tab like uh, suppose you added your sweetheart you added your confident now you want to remove your confident or your sweetheart then you have to use this tab okay but remember it will consume some diamonds to remove your any of your appointed cause sweetheart or confident right so this is about this tab now move to the second gift tab let's see what this can give you now this is some awesome stuff you can see here these are the some avatars uh, or say icons for the your sweetheart first and confident first but when when you reach about 5000 uh, of uh, friendship points friendship point is very simple you have seen uh, right uh, back there let's go back these are the friendship point when you like reach uh, 5000 here then you ca can uh, start appointing sweethearts or confidence okay and you will get the first avatar right now let's go right here you see you going to get this avatar when you reach like uh, 5000 of uh, your friendship point when you reach like 10000 of your friendship point then you going to receive this and uh, for your sweetheart and the, the friend you appointed as your pawn will receive these frames okay now for sweetheart third as you grow your uh, friendship point you will receive more and more of these rewards and now one thing more in close relationship you will uh, start appointing any of your friends as a sweetheart or confidence after you reach uh, to 5000 friendship points that's all for this video i think i have explained everything about the new update about close relationship friendship points and other stuff you all can uh, if you have any doubts after watching this video just please comment down below because your comment is essential if you comment then i even got the new ideas for my next upcoming videos as for further update if there is any changes in it there then i will inform you as new mini game is also coming with uh, some arena changes uh, or many stuff we will see further if there is any let's for this video this is the end and we will meet in the next video with another cool information thanks for watching this video guys